everybody, it's Matt coming to you from Fanfare in Kalamazoo, Michigan. It's time to check out new books for the week. We're going to start off with manga. We're looking at a big old smacking box set right here. This is the Pretty Guardian Sailor Moon. Big old collection. Really cool, really sparkly. It'll help you fight evil by moonlight. We've also got Otto, book number four, and Home Office Romance. Check that out. Sue and Tai Chan, volume number five. We also have a number one here with pretty cool art. This is the Tree of Death. This is... Yonomo Tsuge. We also have One Piece, uh, similar to like the uh, Chainsaw Man guides. This is before One Piece. This is Oda's work prior to that. And the gigantic box, I'm sorry, gigantic book for the amazing, absolutely amazing Trigun storyline. Moving on down to indie comics, big one this week. Check it out, yo. It is Tom Hardy and Scott Snyder. That is accurate. It is the actor Tom Hardy writing a comic book with the incredible author Scott Snyder. It's going to be great. Check that out. We have Battle Action Volume 3, Issue 1. Uh, Distillery's got a few books this week. We have The Big Burn. Uh, Black Hammer is back with Spiral City. Cool Magnolia cover right there. We have The Black Sad. They All Fall Down Part 2. And over here is Calvera P.I. We also have The Dark Empty Void, Number 2. Serge Argonne's Grew Minstrel Melodies. Um, Heat Seeker is back. The Gun Honey Storyline. This is Issue Number 1 of Combustion. We also have Helen of Windhorn, book number six, The Cursed Hermit. We also have The House of Slaughter, Butcher's War right there, and Huge Detective, book number four, three, with the Nux. I love that. I love the covers of these. We have Life uh, from Brian Ozzarello from Distillery, again, number three, The Mammoth, issue five, Minky Woodcocks, the, the Girl Called Cthulhu. We have Monsters Are My Business, paperback from Colin Bunn. Yo, that's cool. Pure Trance by Junko Mizuno beautiful beautiful art i love that super cool over here we have rome eternal uh new number one there from magma comics shutter magazine right there number 20 starved rock issue number one over here we have string number one as well as summer shadows number three the tmnt 40th anniversary comic celebration hardcover as well as tmnt's black white and green same vein as black and white and yada yada all the other books that people do we have tmnt mutant nation book number two another distillery this is time waits from chip sadarsky we also have you and i from straczynski xo man of war right there from the resurgent stuff on the Image Comics, big cool one here. This creep show, the hardcover right there with Gil and March special cover, uh, volumes number one and two in there. Really cool anthology stuff. We have Domain number five, Geiger number seven with its second printing. We have G.I. Joe. It's all built up to this big bad boy. All of like the Duke, Scarlet, Cobra Commander, all those books are leading up to this one part of the Energon universe. Check it out. Can't wait to can't wait to read it. It's gonna be great. Over right, here we have Lady Mechanica book number three, local man paperback. Lore remastered from Ashley Wood. We also have Monstrous with a new paperback. Precious Metals book number six. For Spawn this week, we have Salmon Twitch number eight, as well as Violator number three of six with a very cool cover. Transformers number 14 is going to round out the rest of the shelf. Let's hold up. That's a really, really good one. I like that. Transformers is a paperback as well right there. And Witchblade ties it all together for that. Thank you so much there. And shout outs to Josh for holding it down last week when I was sick. I appreciate it. Over here for the Marvel, we have The Amazing Spider-Man number 61, Captain America number 15, Conquest 2099 number 3, uh, Blood Hunters paperback right there, as well as a Ghost Rider paperback, Final Vengeance, Deadpool number 8. We have Nyx number 5. Over here is a new number 1. It is Psylocke from the Ashes, A New Beginning. Cool cover to choose from, as well as a really neat art trim hiding back there. Spectacular Spider-Man book number nine. We have Star Wars Ewoks number two. Right here is Ultimate X-Men book number nine and the Uncanny X-Men book number five. A few Venoms this week. We have Venom Proper, the number 39, as well as Venom War Deadpool number three and Venom War Wolverine number three. Facsimile copy of, I'm sorry, Web of Spider-Man book number 32. We have Werewolf by Night, the Red Band book number four and X-Men the Manga Remastered. Classic storyline, back in print. Check it out. These are books. On to DC, some new stuff for you. We have Absolute Batman book number two. Book number one was absolutely crazy, super fun, loved it. Can't wait to read number two. We also have this gigantic facsimile oversized copy there of Batman something or other. Uh, C37, limited collector's edition, not sure what it is. We have the noir edition of Absolute Batman number one and Action Comics number 1075, Batman and Robin number 15, Batman Dark Age book number six, Batman Gotham Gaslight Kryptonian age number six, Batman Uncovered, book number one. New number one right there for you to check out. Black Lightning, another new number one. We also have DC Vampires World War V, issue number four. Green Lantern, number 17, and Multiverses, book number five. Wonder Woman has her uh, finest origins and omens. And we have Zatanna and the Ripper, book up top. Very cool. On to some cool media stuff for you this week. 
Borderlands, it's Moxie's Mysterious Memento. We also have G-Fan Magazine, always fun to read if you're into the kaiju stuff. We have Gatchaman. This is June the Swan. It's the Apex Heart storyline. Godzilla here, there'll be Giants 2 with the King Ghidorah issue. We have Power Rangers Prime, a new number one here. Very cool. We have uh, variants. Rick and Morty Youth and Rick Bolt with a new issue right there. We have Star Trek The Lower Decks book number one. Sons of Star Trek paperback. Epic collection of Star Wars droids and Ewoks. Very cool. There's the Ewoks book again. Hiding over here is the prequel trilogy paperback, as well as issue number two of our favorite monster hero, the Toxic Avenger. Issue number two of Turtles of Grayskull and Yars Rising by Atari in Way Forward. So it's video game tie in right there. Some kids' books and a whole lot of toys. We have Adventure Time Fiona and Kate Compendium, Looney Tunes, book number 281. Phineas and Ferb, the Classic Comics Collection 2. For variants, we have the Dustin 9 version variant 1 in 50, as well as the Myers Foil variant 1 in 100 for G.I. Joe 1. All right, for Pops, we've got Wolverine from Wolverine and Deadpool. Uh, a couple entertainment exclusive ones. Here we have Birder, Goldo, and Rikum from the Ginyu Force. Dragon Ball Z, of course. Uh, from One Piece, we have Sanji, Luffy, Zoro, including the Chase Zoro, which is very cool. It's actually dynamically different for once. Nami and Usopp. For thinking of One Piece, we also have these really cool little uh, Van Presto blind boxes. And my big boy Goji right here. You can get in there and get yourself a mini. We also have these, um, Nar <laughs> they're not Naruto this time, they are Gundam Yundums. They are Kitty Gundams, love it. We have some cool Super Mario lights. We have a coin block, red turtle shell, as well as a power-up mushroom. These really, really cool miniature puzzle-type pieces here for Sonic the Hedgehog. Very awesome. And this beautiful, from Mondo, Castlevania Symphony of the Night soundtrack on vinyl. How can you go wrong with that? One of the best soundtracks ever. So thank you for watching, everybody. If you have any questions, our number is 269-349-8866. Have a good night.